Hello, and welcome to Voices on the Street. Today we're asking people, do they feel safe in their community, and why or why not? I feel safe in the community because I think uh, people are basically good and uh, uh, there's no people around to keep the bad people under control. Well, I don't live in Santa Cruz anymore, but in my community, yeah, I feel safe. I don't think I would feel safe in the evening. In the daytime, it's okay as far as I'm concerned. I live in Watsonville. Well, I'm actually a social worker, and so having worked with Latino kids in my community, I, I, I'm always amazed at how when I walk out the door, it's a total different reality for me than for these young children. Yeah, because I'm not aware of certain dangers. Like, I have kids who go, you know, they won't go to this part of town or this part of town because they're afraid of the violence, and I have no idea. So I actually feel safe, but sometimes I think it's maybe a false sense of, sense of safeness. And when I'm in Santa Cruz, I feel fine, but I think there's a lot of undercurrents of violence that you're not really aware of. I, yeah, I feel safe in my community it, because it's, um, um, it, it just feel, it feels, it feels right. It feels like it's good. Um, and that's in Sydney, Australia. Um, so yeah, it's, it's a great, it's a safe place just by the, the type of people that are there. Um, and the the ease of which you you can you're allowed to do things or, or choose to do things and you can do those um, at any time. So it's a, it, feel, it feels free, feels good, feels right. I guess it depends. You know, I usually feel safe because like the environment and the people are really like nice and stuff. But it just depends on like who you're around and like I don't know. <laughs> um, I feel safe in my community where I live in Felton, but not totally here. It seems to be a lot of crime happening more and more lately. Probably more scary at night, that's just how it usually is, but I'm okay during the day. I like downtown. Pretty friendly. I feel safe here. Sometimes I feel a little grossed out, though. I went for a run last night in a levee, and uh, as I was running along the levee, I thought there was an old sleeping bag laying there or a piece of trash or something. And some guy was passed out drunk right there on the levee. And I felt like this poor guy's going to get run over or something like that. And I also tend to get a little upset when people aren't respectful of uh, all the work that all the volunteers do to clean up along the San Lorenzo River. And people throw trash all around and break glass and aren't respectful of other people that are using it. But otherwise, I guess I feel safe. Yeah, I feel safe in the community. Why? Because... Uh... I don't watch crime stories on TV. Yes, I do. In the part of the community that I am in, for the most part, walking around here and late at night and up on Mission, I feel very safe. Um, but I realize that there are parts of Santa Cruz that I don't go to that are not safe. And I had, I guess, the, the privilege and the fortune to not necessarily have to. So um, there's an inequity there in terms of where people, you know, because of socioeconomics, are forced to live. For me, is yes, but I don't think other people are. And there's too many people out here that quite bluntly don't care about anything I, I'm not even looking at the ones that are addicted I'm looking at the ones that are walking around the suit and tie they're completely oblivious to the world how can they be safe I do and I don't it depends uh, usually you, I think you have to feel safe within yourself and who and how you are and present yourself but there are a lot of issues going on here that I've seen change since like the 80s that are you know really intensely uh, dangerous sometimes. Yes, because I live in a safe community, which is Berkeley. So I don't live here. But um, because I feel like the government structure of this area has been doing a fine job cleaning up the streets and keeping the residents safe. Oh, yeah, because it's completely boring and nothing happens, good or bad. It's the suburbs. I feel very safe in my community um, and I feel safe because there's not a lot of crime here and uh, people are very friendly and I leave my doors unlocked. I mean, I feel really safe. I feel safe in my community. I uh, lived here all my life, so I'm comfortable with my surroundings. Um, I live in Boulder Creek now, so it's all, all good up in Boulder Creek. Yes, I do feel safe in my community because it's a safe community. Um, not sure about the rest of the world though. I feel pretty safe, but I'm not sure if I should feel very safe. I may be overconfident about my feelings of safety. Um, I hear sirens in my neighborhood every day and I hear horrible things from people. Um, and so yeah, I don't really know why I don't feel less safe. I do feel safe. 
And I feel safe because uh, I believe that people are basically good. We have had some problems here recently, you know, with gangs and stuff. But I feel overall safe. Yeah, yeah, so it's, it's a pretty safe community. Basically, you know, uh, I don't foresee too many problems, you know. Sometimes there's there's fools, you know, that <laughs> screw with people. But other than that, you know, I mean, it's, it gets in every city's, you know. Yes, I do. Generally, I feel very safe. Um, however, you know, with the with some of the stabbings and shootings, all that stuff, it's a concern, you know. But luckily, you know, I don't, I haven't bumped into that much. And in general, I think uh, there's so many peaceful people here. It certainly, you know, out balances the the violence. Yeah, sure. I don't even lock our door. I'm not telling you where I live. <laughs>